Greetings everyone, this is the Gardening Snail of Livingston, California, and today I am at the corner of Hammett and Campbell, where there are plans to build a new ARCO AMPM facility with convenience store, car wash, vacuum stations, and quick serve restaurant. On Tuesday's Planning Commission, there is a proposal for an ARCO AMPM at the corner of Hammett and Campbell. I've got the staff report pulled up right here, so let's go through it and see what the description and some of the items that are going to be in this ARCO are going to be. It says here, the applicant Raja Chandi Group is proposing to develop the 2.37 acre property into a highway service center with several related uses. The applicant proposes to construct an ARCO fueling station, which would provide a total of 10 pumps for dispensing gasoline and diesel fuel to passenger vehicles and light duty trucks under a 5,776 square foot covered canopy. A 6,300 square foot building in the eastern portion of the site would be divided into a proposed, okay, here we go, square uh, convenience store and cashier area, a quick service restaurant. And go a little further, a freestanding structure behind the convenience store and restaurant would contain an automated car wash, which would have one wash bay. Near the center of the project, a two bay diesel fueling station for heavy duty trucks with a 1,008 square foot cam canopy would be constructed, which would provide three high flow diesel dispensers with four nozzles. The proponent also proposes to construct a standalone full service restaurant approximately 2,800 square feet in size at the western edge of the site. Next paragraph, the convenience store will be open 24 hours, seven days per week and will sell the typical snacks, drinks, and food items. Beer, wine, and tobacco sales are also proposed in accordance with city regulations. Let's go down a little farther. Uh, next paragraph, a total of 77 parking spaces would be provided to serve the proposed uses. Uh, let's see, go down a little further in this paragraph. Two handicap accessible spaces are among the parking spaces serving the standalone full service restaurant. Let's go down to the next paragraph. Access to the highway serve center would be exclusively from Campbell Avenue. No access will be from Hammett Avenue. Uh, let's go down a little bit further. Next paragraph. Now we have a paragraph of what it's supposed to look like. Let's go down a little bit further. Let's go to the last paragraph before we get to environmental review. The Planning Commission is the approving body for the conditional use permit and the recommending body for a site plan and design review with the City Council being the approving body. Therefore, this proposal must go before both bodies. All right, let's go down. We're going to analysis uh, last paragraph and analysis as noted in the environmental review section fire has identified various needs they feel are caused by the project the need for an opticon system is addressed on a proportional fair share basis and the proposed conditions of approval all right uh, the staffing, equipment, and funding needs of the fire department are addressed in the proposed conditions of approval requiring the project to develop or annex into the recently formed non-residential community facilities district. Okay, let's go down uh, into recommendation. Staff is of the opinion that the proposed use is consistent with the envisioned 
for this area with for with that envisioned for this area and will be an asset to the city providing additional fueling and dining options. All right, skip down a little farther. Okay, list of attachments. Uh, what I'm going to do is in the description for this video, I'm going to put in a link that if, if you want to, you can get to the agenda packet and read the entire staff report and go through all of these attachments if you wish. So what do you think? Let me know.